Hem, hem, Sharky. That cough today sounded rough, Cass. <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> no, I'm I'm boiling are, are over. Okay? I've got venom in okay? my throat. I've got an acid tongue, and I'm coming for you. No, Cass. Uh, no, I'm serious. I'm worried. Are you okay? I'm fine. How are you doing? Bust the wolf! Because <laughs> I'm tight. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Allergies, you know. Uh, Tis yeah. the season, as they say. Welcome, audience, to another fight night. Another battle of the minds of reflexes. Of, of two warriors enter. Both of us leave. None of us are like, you know, we're not yeah. leaving it in the ring. I think we're going to walk out, you know, okay. But one of us will be a winner. One of us will be a loser. Uh, last I, I might time, get a sore arm by the end of this, but, you know, I'll, I'll live. Last time, it was me who was the loser in Sharky who came out on top. And I'm, I'm hoping... I'm working to reverse that. I was practicing some fighting games last night. Uh, funnily enough, none of the games that I had actually picked to play tonight, that probably would have helped if I had played specifically the games that I'm I've bringing also, to the table today. <laughs> I, I know I know Cassidy is prepared for this. He's prepared to try and win because uh, I didn't get any sleep, and that's because Cass just kept sending me messages and pinging my phone every five minutes <laughs> just saying good luck tomorrow good luck tomorrow good luck tomorrow good luck tomorrow and so i think th i don't know if that's cheating i, I just call that like, a strategy i just call that a plan paying off I, I just call that you know all my my thoughts uh, all my my ideas my machinations coming to fruition personally well i'm gonna i'm gonna work through being very tired and i have an energy drink with me tonight tonight's stream stack is uh, the Mango Loco again, because I just want to get rid of all of these first, because this flavor fucking sucks. And I'm drinking a Monster Energy Ultra Peachy Keen. I also have the tequila here for the oh. drink ups, but uh, I, I've been on Ultra this Monster Peachy Energy Keen. kick. Sounds good. Yeah. It is pretty good. It's one of the zero sugar ones, so I know you don't give a shit about it, but. Like I uh, said, it, any fruit drink. Does it have ar if it has artificial sweet sweetener in it, I don't like it. Yeah, that <laughs> parses. But, uh, yeah. Fight games. We each brought three. For those of you, this is if this is your first for, uh, fight night. You know, it's only the second. So that means Sharky have done only a third in the series. But uh, each of us bring three games to the table, and uh, we also have a tiebreaker game in the event of a tiebreaker. But we're keeping score. Whoever wins by the end of the night is the winner. I don't. There's got to be a better way to to parse that or, or phrase that. The winner is the one who wins. The loser uh, is the one who is not win. And and I'm sorry, I need to investigate this. Johnny Baghead said my stream snacks pepperoni Doritos. Is pepperoni Doritos like a flavor y'all have over there in England? Or did you literally just put pepperonis on Doritos? That's one way to make like a little sandwich. That's a little... They have the pizza flavored Pringles and you put the pepperoni on top of that. And that, that's what I call a sweet treat. I was at the I was at the supermarket the other day and I saw they have spicy Pringles now. To what end, I don't yeah. know. It was just, I, I, I should have figured as much. It makes sense, but I just, I never Did, thought about it. I just never, I'd never seen it before that moment. What, one quick aside to just explain why I made a you sound. It wasn't or spicy Pringles. That kind of makes sense. Uh, this is a total apropos of nothing. Two, yeah, two hours ago, uh, someone in the house texted me and said, like, are you going to eat supper? And I said, like, yeah, I'll have some suffer in a little bit i have spoken to that person four times in the past two hours and they just sent me a text back in reference to the supper thing saying okay great <laughs> <laughs> you're not gonna go eat supper right now i presume i no i i have other stream snack uncrustables very good well in that case on that note let us load the fight night screen there is the scoreboard which will be updated in real time as as we emerge victorious. By we, I mean me. Both. I'm I'm in a positive grind set right now. PMA positive mental attitude. I'm visualizing the win, and you know since I lost last time, I think it's only fair that I we pick the, the same, first game. We're on the same page because I'm in the assuming I'm going to lose grind tonight. Well, so then you're, you'll pleasantly your surprise pick? yourself. <laughs> you know, that's that's the strategy is because you will pleasantly. You know, if you think you're going to lose, then you win. It's that much sweet, or that much sweeter victory, or so I've been told. 
Uh, the first game we're going to play tonight is an unlicensed fighter for the Sega Genesis, released in the year 2000. It is Top Fighter 2000 MK8. Uh, this game, I know this game, because this game was recently featured on a, um, God Win Quote video. It was? Yeah, it was his April 1st video. Not an April 1st joke video, I mean a video he happened to release on April 1st. It's quite the cast of characters in this game. Yeah. <laughs> quite the cast. All right, you got all that, everyone? Yep. Welcome to Mortal <laughs> Kombat 8. <laughs> uh, let's make sure the controls are set up. Because I was having some controller issues last night, funnily enough. Yeah, you'll be second player. I'll be first. This is like Some guy saw this game and thought like, that's a good idea, and then they went on to make Mugen. <laughs> well, Jeff Gersman recently played uh, Street Fighter II IBM, which is a a DOS version of Street Fighter II that had, like, you know, random Mortal Kombat characters and stuff, and that was as early as, like, 94, 95. So there is definitely some precedent for uh, yeah, but this, this crossover is a wide. This is definitely a wide crossover. <laughs> Let, let's got... go through these characters. You go through them. All right, we got uh, Middle Joden. We got G's. R R you. Yeah, I don't know who Goku. that guy is. Yep. Eo. Spikel. Ali. And Rio. Not to be confused, but for you. First man of fighting games, games right here. No. Okay. Uh, we're gonna go through all these characters first. We'll do some just like some quickies, and then we will get to the fights. After I feel like we gotta go with we gotta start with the marquee fight, right? Yeah, Michael Jordan versus Muhammad Ali. Yeah, the dream match. It is start to select on the screen, by the way. Ah, okay, thank you. <laughs> Round one, fight! All right, kick, punch. Oh, yeah, two button fighter. Okay, two button. Got it. B oh, and seems... C on the Genesis controllers. It, it seems um, that the Mega Drive is confused about what buttons I'm pressing at any given time, especially if I try to press them too fast. Uh, yeah, that's, that's this game. Uh, it does not have the best uh, control, to say it charitably. I was playing uh, a little bit of this last night, and so I, I did lie at the beginning. I did practice this one a little bit uh, for all the good it did me, because I couldn't even get Ryu's Hadoken to come out. Like, Are you sure it has one? <laughs> I, I, it happened once. Okay. Also, I tried well, to look up a move stocks. list for this game. Why did I try to look up a move list for this game? <laughs> of course there's not a you, move you list for know. this game. <laughs> you never know. Did you, did you check Dust Loop? I guess I didn't. I guess I didn't think to. Uh, Backlash oh, Jack asking, is this Sango Fighter? Not quite. <laughs> but I do know it. I figure if I'm a charge character. Uh, no, I just think most characters don't happen to have... Oh! That was a half circle in Punch. Try half circles. Oh, well, I found something. I think every character has, like, a grand total of, like, one or two specials, maybe. The thing is, we're building up Super Meter up there. I have, we both have three stocks, so I don't know how that is spent. I'm not sure what happened midair there, but... I'm also trying to press, you know, buttons at the same time, all three buttons, see if yeah, that, that maybe does something. Oh. I think we seem to accept at a certain point that uh, we're not going to be able to fully control this game. Yeah. 
pop near us. So where they get these sprites from? All over the place. Oh well, I'm guessing these two sprites. I know Ali is stuff. traced off of a King of Fighters character. At least the bottom yeah. half is. I do think, like, some of the wiki articles that do exist for this game on, like, bootleg games wiki and otherwise do say, like, uh, where all these sprites are taken from. Like, you know, like, specifically which Dragon Ball game the Goku sprite is taken from, etc. Which is, which is handy. Good to know. It seems like if you want to do a special, uh, just a normal special move, you have to give every button a lot of room to breathe. Well done. Thank you. Of course, this is not the scoring. This, this, this yeah. is not the scoring round. We are just getting used to the game at this point. Right back to the character select. That's good. That's handy. No wasted time. Oh, yeah. uh, uh, Red Cyclops guess... looks so weird. You know what? I'll be Cyclops. I'll be Baby Blue Ryu. Oh, uh, Bobinator did redeem a Say Something Nice, by the way. Uh... <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Uh... <laughs> it's certainly a creative cast of characters. I'll pick left. I'll pick left. Oh, I see what you mean about the, uh... Oh. I feel like that is unblockable. What is that? <laughs> that was just my half circle. It felt like I had a good rhythm going there for like a second. But it's so... Well, why am I even pretending like I could do a dragon punch with this input reader? I will say I did see Ryu doing a dragon punch uh, when I played against them as a bot. The moves are in there, they're just arcane inputs. Round two, fight! Some point out this is the uh, the Power Rangers theme. Bobinator specifically pointing out this is the Power Rangers theme playing right now. You know what's great? Hold down and forward and try punching. I can't punch. Yeah, if you just hold down, you can do a punch like, you know, this. But if you do down and forward, which I usually won't to do if I'm trying to do a crouching punch. Okay, well, first of all, uh, down forward crouching punch shouldn't do anything different than just down <laughs> yeah. crouching punch. That's, yeah, no, in a perfect world. But, yeah, it's all... But, um... Final round, fight! It, yeah, it, like, that's what I was saying. Like, you seem to need to give, like, the buttons room to breathe. Oh, that's a low. Oh, okay. That goes up so high that I thought that was a normal. That's why I couldn't block it. Yeah, I give up on trying to figure out what reuse moves are. <laughs> I'm just going to go for normals. <laughs> that might be the winning move with this game. Wasting too much time trying to figure out how to do specials, which aren't don't seem to be super I'll, effective either. So also, I, I said I thought uh, Cyclops's optic blast was a uh, normal. I meant to say a mid. <laughs> I was playing Idol Showdown the other night, and they called mids normals for some reason. So I got mixed up. Oh, you can change colors. Oh, that that's okay. Someone redeemed to say something nice again. No, no, we, that's, oh, I guess, okay, you know what, we'll hold on to it. We'll hold on to this one. I, I can be... Yeah, I'll be purple key. I mean, the black is iconic, but... Round one, fight! Half circle is not a Kamehameha for Goku. Oh, there he is. There, there we go. The timing is just fucking rotten. Oh, no, no, it's actually Shoryuken for, for Hadouken in this case. Oh, you know Kyo, famously a charge character? No, wait, wait, I want to test something. Hold on. Oh, sorry, I was reading. But... 
No, it Keo is a charge character, I think. Because I'm trying just back forward. Wait, what? What is his move? Because back forward. And back. I mean, you're asking like, you know, what are the controls in this game? Yeah. A game where the controls are just like as lousy as I've ever seen. I I like almost found it because he was doing it when I was charging for a while, but now he's decided to stop doing it. Is he like, sorry, I'm out of fire. Like, so try it now. No. I was thinking maybe it was. Oh. Oh wait. Oh, oh now it's doing it, but it was doing it on a half circle motion. Okay, I was totally not doing half circles though when I was doing it earlier. I was doing a charge. Like I'm not that fingering my hand down on the bottom of the the uh, knee pad. This game works in mysterious ways. Any move other than. No, I think it is. That was Promise, a I'm half circle backwards I'm, kick. I'm trying to do inputs like this is a real game. Like, this is like. <laughs> yeah. I have to learn. I have to learn, like, a new style of how to play a fighting game if I want to actually pull off a move. Like. <laughs> Like, worse than trying to learn how to do a move in uh, Primal Rage. <laughs> yeah, now it's just not worth. I think, I think the thing is, I think the thing I have to accept is that maybe just, even if you do the move right, even if you give it room to breathe, sometimes the game's just like, no, don't feel like it. Not in the mood. Come back later. Try again later. Oh, there's still a third round of this? <laughs> yeah, <I'm> tried. <laughs> I, I think when we get to the end, this one can go either way. Like, this yeah, one, no, this, this one game is truly is, random. This one is the great equalizer. What are those stocks for? What, how do you <laughs> supposed to use those? Are they just cosmetic? There, there's probably some arcane like super motions in this. Magic Mouse pointing out the great equalizer in round one. <laughs> round one is six tonight. All right, who's that leave right, us with? not seen. Geese and Rio. Rio. Yeah, well. Apropos. Go with default geese. I'll go with yellow so there's a bit more standing out here visually. Round one! Dare I, dare I figure out if I have a double Rapukin? Might as well. I don't think I do. <laughs> Ooh. Hey, At least PSC hey, asks two moves with this character. if we have any King of Fighters experts uh, in the chat. Geese is the one who let his kid be with Terry, right? That is how I seem to recall it. Well, I'm not sure if let is... I don't know if let is the thing. I do know that Rock Howard uh, was basically... Uh, Semi adopted by Terry, or at least Terry, he's Terry's ward. I don't know if Geese was like, okay, Terry, here you go. I don't think that seems like it's a Geese's character. Round two, fight! Yeah, um. <laughs> Video Game King says for a definition of let, because Geese <laughs> did get his ass killed by Terry. <laughs> okay. I do like uh, Garu. I think that's a fun game. Yeah, I like Garu. You seen any of the uh, trailers for the new one? That's no, coming out? I didn't even know there was a new one coming out. 
There is. They, uh, I forgot what the name of the new one is. But they're going for like an American comic style in terms of the graphics. It doesn't look bad. Uh, SNK, current SNK has definitely gotten better at 3D. Uh, but I'm really hoping Freeman is in there. Like, Freeman was like my favorite character in Garu. And he's even, he's even a character who does charge moves, and I don't like charge characters. <laughs> but I really like Freeman. Alright, we've seen everyone we can see in this game. Barring any secret characters that are undocumented. Uh, I'm gonna go with Cyclops. You're going with Cyclops? I, I like... I liked how we, I liked how we looked when you played it. Backlash Jack says it's weird calling it Garu 2 since Fatal Fury 2 is Garu 2. Yeah, it's <laughs> the naming thing is weird if you consider how America named it. <laughs> All these things. I'll go with Ryu. Make this a Street Fighter versus X Men. But, yeah, this is the intro to X Men versus Street Fighter, where like Ryu and Cyclops come in and they shake hands. Oh, there won't be any handshaking after this. This is this is for all the marbles, as I say. Good start. <laughs> Ooh. All right, half circle oh, for sure you can. Oh, or no, course, it's yeah. also Hadoken. The same motion gives me two different things. It's probably, it's probably like a dragon punch motion for Shoryuken, but the input reader is probably so bad that um, it's like, I don't know, one or the other. Also, input reader might not be the right word for it. I don't know what the word for the thing in a fighting game that parses what buttons you're pressing. And this is playing like a Street Fighter 2 competitive match right now with all these Hadokens. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> oh, I have a... Oh, double, is that KO? a double KO? Double KO? Is it? No, you have no! a sliver of health. I can see it. Yeah. I'd have taken the double KO on that one. I'd have given up a round to have a double KO on that. <laughs> Back Backlash Jack says input parser. That is the word I was looking for. Thank you. Also... I have a Shoryuken too, Shoryuken 2, and I don't know how I did it. Oh, that is such a stu- look at- look at how stubby this crouching kick is. Ooh, yeah, that's- that's like squishing a sprite so it fits within a certain uh, pixel parameter. <laughs> I can't go for jumpins. That was- I was not trying to jump in on that one. I was trying to do Hadouken to counter that. Okay, can't, can't jump over that. At least not straight up in the air. I got, I'm trying to do a poke with, with a crouching kick, and I have to be like, no, no, he's like... Cyclops has a condition where he just, like, loses most of the mass of his leg. <laughs> Please, game. Please. I need to not go for pokes. <laughs> this character cannot poke. <laughs> All right. Yes! Good job. Yes! Victory lap! Right. Oh! Yeah, good start. <laughs> <laughs> oh, everything's coming up. Cast, baby! Ooh, yeah, hit my fucking screen. Oh, yeah, no modesty. I'm the best. Woo! Yeah! <laughs> I'm the greatest Top Fire 2000 player in the world! Yep. <laughs> well, Chuck, I don't know how you're going to come back from that one, but uh, good luck! Yeah, uh, I, 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 don't think, I don't think I can catch up at this point. <laughs> you might it's as well just concede lead. now, but we got to put on a show, so you'll have to enjoy yeah. the next five losses coming from me aware of uh, drink up redeemed <laughs> yeah I, I i've had mine <laughs> here we go ah, tastes like victory all right tastes like really bad mango <laughs> <laughs> that's victory to me pick a game any game of the three games right. you told me in advance that you wanted to play tonight <laughs> all right um 
I'm going to I'm going to save my favorite one for the middle. I'm going to save my worst one for last. So let's do Mortal Kombat 4. Sure. <laughs> we'll be playing the PlayStation 1 version of this, the uh the 1998 PlayStation 1 release. So we generally pick one good game and two bad ones. Uh I don't think Mortal Kombat 4 is a bad one, but I it has a I think the average person would look at Mortal Kombat 4 and be like, oh, that one? Uh, Why is the resolution weird on this? Fixed. Okay, cool. This is actually a game that I am planning on learning how to speedrun at some point. Wait, no, it keeps it keeps making itself p pillar boxed. Development limited entertainment software games. Strange. Give me a second. That's annoying the shit out of me. Let's just call it 4x3. Four four. Let me just force 4x3 four in this situation. Electronics. Just because it should be 4x3. Won't imagine. Yeah, I... Re it yep, keeps it stretching again. out! Hey, RetroArch, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Fine, I'll just fucking crop it. If you're going to be like that, right. RetroArch. The shattering blow of the oh, live action. I've never seen this because I've never played the uh, PlayStation version of this before. This game was so hyped back in the day. Did they have a full Mortal Monday campaign around this? That I don't know. But anyway, yeah, I actually recently joined the uh, Mortal Kombat speedrunning Discord because I'm planning on learning to speedrun this. And maybe special forces, but my focus is kind of on uh, Mortal Kombat 4. That's not going to help with tonight, because speedrunning this game is not how you play against a human being. Yeah. Uh, rounds to win two, continues three, sure. Yeah, this will be just fine. Yeah. I oh, did not download a, a full save a or whatever. Oh. Go to options again. Just go to controller configs, just so we can see what the buttons are. So run, sidestep in, sidestep in. Oh, button now, to block. This block. is going to fuck me up. I, I always oh, forget that Mortal I... Kombat's a, a button to block game. I'm not good with button to block. Can I change my controller on here? Yeah. I, I uh, in the like... meantime, let me look at chat real quick. Uh, Quint728 saying, A Twitch channel dedicated to bad video games. Where has this been all my life? At badgamehalloffame.com. <laughs> Thank you for discovering us. I'm glad you found us after your whole life. Uh, Backlash okay. Jack asks, what about the bad GBA Mortal Kombat port? We actually played that recently-ish. Uh, was that on the last Bad Game Chance Time, episode number three? It might have been? If not, it was okay. number two. It was number two or three. It was one of those nights. Oh. Low punch, high punch, low kick, high kick. Okay, that, that feels good to me. I do like how, if I wanted to, I could make every button, like, high Nothing kick. but high kicks, baby! That's all I need. Okay, low punch, high punch, low kick, high kick. All right. Was good. that not the default? No. By the way, I do like how if you, as you press buttons on here, like it kind of zooms in on the controller saying like, it's this one. That is cute. Or this one. Yeah, okay, yeah, so I guess that wasn't. Yeah, so yeah. Okay, you figured out how to do it. <laughs> yeah, this, this is how I like it. Wait, no, this should be high kick. And then low kick. I punch, low punch. Okay, good enough is... This is not the version I'm going to learn either for the speedrun thing. I have the PC version. Because that's the only one I can do real hardware for. All right. I don't think we'll go through every character in this. But we will at least like warm up a little bit by playing a few different characters before we get into the match. Also, we're not playing gold, as obviously, but uh, gold has some broken-ass characters in it. If you know how to use them, like, Sector is Point. fucked. <laughs> okay. Do you mind if I do something? Sure. I, I don't even know if this is going to work. No, no, no list of uh, moves. No. Also, how did I do so little damage to you between... 
I thought uppercuts would do more damage than that, but... Didn't more, like, uppercuts used to be, like, devastating? Uh... They used to do a fair bit. Not sure if devastating is the word, but... So, uh... Oh, fuck. One aspect of this game is that... Except for, um... Your weapons and your special moves... Uh, every move is basically universal, so every character has the same combo strings. There's some difference in terms of, like, uh, the size of your character model and, like, how much reach you might have, as I remember it. But everyone in this game plays very similar. It's fucked how little damage I'm doing with all this. Also, I think everyone also has, like, a unique um, input for their weapon, and I don't know I just figured out mine by complete accident, as you were mentioning that. I wasn't even trying to. I was trying to do the slide, the Sub-Zero slide, which is so good on Mortal Kombat 4 on the Game Boy Color, but uh, could not figure it out in this game. Well, I guess I have another round. Round three. Okay, this was the game that, as you can see, this was the game that introduced weapons. I'm trying to remember. There we go. I think it's. How do you pick yeah, stuff down, up, by the way? Down and run, I believe. Well, uh oh. We don't know any fatalities, I'm assuming. No. Well, we gotta see this at least once. I have a story, right? I was a young lad when I played this game for the first time. Very young child. I played this in the arcade. And, like, I was not allowed to play Amir. I think I was told the story in stream on the Resident Evil stream before. But, uh, I wasn't allowed to play M games, but I managed to get permission to play Mortal Kombat 4 in the arcade once. And when I saw all the blood from the first hit, I was so shocked. Like, I got scared, and I ran out of the arcade. <laughs> and, like, I only peeked my head back in to see my character die and fall down that pit. <laughs> and I was like, uh, Twisted. See, that's the, that's the thing. They my, th my parents thought that they were protecting me by make, making sure I didn't see violent video games. But what they were doing was making it so that I was, like, fucked up from seeing, like, fake-ass blood. And even that was like, oh, no. By being exposed to it so late, you mean? Yeah. I... Backlash, Jack, uh, Backlash Jack saying you were 22 at the time when that happened. Yes. <laughs> yes, I am. I am 53 years old. <laughs> Ooh. I don't even know how I did that. I might know how I did that. <laughs> yeah, to, to be clear, this is not expert play from either yeah. of us. We are not experts in all the games we're playing tonight. We just pick ones that seem fun. Sharky has played also, more fighting games than me, but I've got the spirit. I've got the, the moxie, and I've got the... Uh... I did say I was learning to speedrun Mortal Kombat 4. I did not say I was learning competitive Mortal Kombat 4. <laughs> Ooh. Uh oh. <laughs> Round three. Okay. One second. If you do not mind. Just in case. Fatalities? Yes. Get mine too. Or at least mine. Okay. <laughs> Mega Drivers in chat saying LMFO. My mom scared the shit out of me by bringing home Splatterhouse 3 once. Splatterhouse rules. Fucking rules. Splatterhouse rules. Uh, uh, Johnny Cage. Not afraid to die. Can't find him on this list. Here he is. Okay. Uh, got it. Okay. Shit. Oh, 
Oh, shit. I know this isn't the match anyway, but... Oh, I thought that would hit you in the air! Oh, well. Nah. You want a second go with that? Oh, okay, wait a sec. Wait a sec. Oh, I can <laughs> pause. Wow, that's... That's, that's helpful. Amazing. Okay. That doesn't sound right. Okay. Forward, back, up, up, high kick. Okay. Try different uh, give distance. Me a, yeah. No, I didn't have enough time. <laughs> you get one more shot at this. Well, well, yeah. Uh, let's see. Try down, up, 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 high punch. Oh, it's close. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Forward, forward, back, up, up, high kick. Well, you blew it. One more shot, uh, please. One no, more shot. Come on. No, I no, that's it. Time. I didn't have enough time. <laughs> ah. yeah. Backlast Jack asking, Splatterhouse 3, presumably, is the, has your family dying if you don't finish the levels quick enough. That is correct. And uh, one of them is really fucked up. <laughs> Round one. All right. One more and then the match? Yeah, okay. I think so. Go with, uh... Sonya Blade, first lady of video games. Sonya. Let's see if I remember a goddamn thing about this girl. She's not a charge character, is she? No, no, no character in Mortal Kombat is charged. Oh, thank God. But also, just so you know, no character is uh, like a quarter circle motion either. It's always just two buttons. You failed me, Sonya. <laughs> oh, what's what's the fucking what's the sauce of this guy? I forgot how to how do I pull out his weapon? That's if I could figure that out. I'm trying different shit too, just to. I know what Oops. that move was, but it looked like a cool grab. Should be the the yeah scissor grab thing, I think. I'm guessing that might actually be. Mm, I don't know. I even know how you do throws in this game, generally. Round three, point. <laughs> Ha! Oh, shit. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, there it goes. Get out of here with that shit. Okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> forward, forward, forward. Oh, Jesus Christ. Forward. Forward, forward, down, block, and high kick and low kick. Okay. Good luck! Down, and... Okay. That... Let, let me try. No, fuck that it. was it, man. They really censored the fatalities past a certain point. Yeah, there is a cheat to get easy fatalities, but uh, yeah, we're already this deep into it. All right, so is this next match the last one? Uh. Or, do, or you want to do one more practice of somebody else? Let me do one more practice. How about one more practice? Okay. Yeah. Everyone's favorite character, Reiko. Everyone's favorite character, Jarek. <laughs> Round one, fight! I mean, they definitely gave Reiko a fucking glow up in uh, Mortal Kombat 1. Every dog has his day. Doesn't he have the what best ending oh, in this game, too, where he just silently yes. walks up and, and sits in a chair, and that's it? Yeah, and, like, everyone... No, he walks up, and he sits in a chair and puts on Shao Kahn's mask. 
and people were assuming the lore was like, oh, he's he's secretly Shao Kahn, like this is a young Shao Kahn or something, or, or this is a disguised Shao Kahn like taking his throne back. And then I think the lore explanation afterwards, the, the way they cleared it up, was saying like, no, he's actually just a huge Shao Kahn like fanboy or something who's pretending to be wanted to be him. him. Oh, you kicked my ass. Okay, wait. Tell, tell me, yeah. Also, Bob and I right. redeemed a uh, say something nice again. I like this game. I think this game is actually fun to play. I'm sure it's fine. This is maybe not my favorite version of it, but um, okay. Oh, are you ready? Uh, as ready All as right. I'll ever be. <clears throat> okay, stand, stand far away. Oh, this one's easy. Stand far away from me. Back, back, down, down, high kick. <laughs> Fuck off. Are these... Are these just wrong? Do these not... <laughs> work for the PlayStation? Yeah, no, whatever... Whatever fucking list you're looking at... MKSecrets.net Well... It says... That should have been the easiest one. It said outside sweep. We'll never know. Yeah, the other moves are right, so I don't, I don't know. All right, hit start. Huh, I did do pretty good as Reiko there. I'm thinking about this. Yeah. But I, th I think my go-to guy has always been Sub-Zero. He's just, you know... The easiest. Yeah. Like, I could, I could be real cheesy with Liu Kang, but Tanya is, like, my favorite to play as. Just casually. Round one, fight. Oh, I figured out how to do the slide. This is the only move you need in uh, in the Game Boy Color version of this game, which I'm more of an expert at. Shit. Uh, well played. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, like, the cheese that works really well against the AI with that move is probably not going to work against the human. <laughs> I try to remember that that button there. Shit. This is the worst case scenario. Ooh. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Wait a minute. Up uh, down well played, forward, Sharky. down. Thank you. Down forward, down forward, high kick. Watch it not fucking work. Oh, oh. loading. One, a two, a three, three. three. Mm. three. Fatality. Was it worth it? Absolutely. <laughs> well, let's hit your you screen. I got to see one. come back just in time to see yeah that <laughs> one I'm sorry. on one it's okay all right that was mortal kombat 4 on playstation 1 we were it's, it's all even now uh what do i want to pick next i'll pick i'll pick my good game for the night is a bit of an oddball one. Oh, I think I'm loading the wrong emulator for this. 
Yeah, let, let's do it like this. Yeah, much better. This is Kenju, uh, developed by Dream Factory, published by Sammy, except it never actually came out. Meant to come out in 2004, but alas, it did not. So here we are playing this this prototype build that leaked out some time ago. This is this runs on Sammy Atomus Wave hardware, which is just basically a Dreamcast. Uh, I know we've moved on to another game, but I, I kind of just want to acknowledge something in chat. Uh, Video Game King says, mechanically speaking, this looks and acts more like a 2D fighting game than a 3D one. Uh, yeah, this uh, Mortal Kombat 4, I would say, is like way closer to like Mortal Kombat 3 than it is Deadly Alliance. So yeah, it does feel like a 2D Mortal Kombat game. But uh, fuck that, we're playing Kenju. Yeah, uh, this game has sauce for days, style for days, even in this unfinished state. I'm letting it introduce our cast of characters. Age unknown, job unknown, favorite food, we know that. <laughs> we have that detail. Our surveillance teams have uncovered that detail. It's, it's mainly because he just goes around everywhere yelling, Fruits! We eat fruits! <laughs> Jinju! There are some awesome characters in this game. I need to take the first controller slots. Okay. Thanks, RetroArch, for always doing this. Okay. I thought I hit start in time. Alright. Let's quick okay. save there. You hit start, too. Oh, wait. Sorry. No? I'm, I'm in the window. Hit your start button. Okay. And, and as long as we're here, press your... Because uh, I, I think some of these are just blatantly wrong, looking at the screen here. Uh, okay. Give me your PlayStation Cross, Circle, Square, Triangle. I don't remember this game uses L and R, but give me L. Give me R. Okay. And fuck it, give me select. Why not, right? And fuck it, give me L too. Why not? Okay. I mean, Dreamcast did not have these not. buttons. So. Oh, uh, Johnny Baggin pointing out that, yes, we are getting cut off on the sides there a little bit. That's because I had to, because the PlayStation there kept fucking up. So, thank thank you. That's a good pointing out. Good thing we didn't get into the actual game and it was being cut off there. All right. This should with any luck, work. But let me double check this as well. Let me see if the whole issue just came down to... Yeah, sure enough. I'm controller, you're controller. We're all controller. Okay. Press start. Bong! All right, quick save here. Okay. I know what character you're gonna wanna play, and it's the character I wanna play. <laughs> oh, look at this alternate outfit! These the characters Wait, like, go, like, go all down all the way again. Oh yeah, fuck it. Yeah, mirror match. Slay man v slay man. Slay man. Uh, Do I select anything here or is just telling me? Uh, no, you select them. You select what you want oh, like okay. your super to be, basically. Uh, by, by pressing the button left, yeah. Whoop. Well, it picked for me. So I don't know. Oh, what, you get to pick can the you stage. rewind very briefly? Nope, there's no rewind in this. <laughs> fuck. Go here. I have no idea what my special is. <laughs> Ooh, sound emulation. Yeah, That's not great. great. Prototype. Jinx. One. Air drive, okay. Those is four button game or we yeah, four, four button, buttons, yeah. Like. It's all about getting your opponent up in the air. Not in the juggling sense, but uh, all your supers and specials seem to be like getting them up in the air to do like some follow up attacks. I can tell there are a lot of mechanics in this game I don't know. <laughs> I don't know them either. Pressure, I just danger. Go based on feel. Hit air drive is okay now. 
This is the air drive. Ah. Close. He's very polite, Slay Man. He's an archaeologist, by the way. I can tell. Yeah, it's like a dust that's uh, tied to a meter. Or Guilty Gear dust. These characters are all very Guilty Gear coded. Yeah. Who developed this again? Dream Factory. Oh, that uh, air guys, right? Yeah, and also uh, Tobol. Well done. Thank you. And also, as Backlash point, uh, Blacklash Jack, Backlash Jack points out the bouncer. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know this guy's moves at all, but like, I just like his style. <laughs> yeah, no, absolutely. That's a throw. Which is just close up and I think uh, Punch will do it. Ah. Let's see if he apologizes again. Nope. Sorry, got Rude. a jet. Don't have time to apologize. Goodbye. Your character. Let's quick load. This lady seems cool too. I like I'll her be horns. his Drake. I'll be his Drake. I'll get in my feelings. Look at that JoJo fucking birthmark on this on this dweeb. Look at those fucking nipples. <laughs> on who? Yeah, <laughs> uh, you know what? Good point. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, let's try this. The MS Tornado. Oh, I guess I'm always picking the stage. I think it's second coin's privilege to the pick stage. Oh, that's mean. Oh. Unique uh, dialogue. Rude? Oh. Ah. Oh, whatever I did there fucking worked. Yeah. <laughs> so this game's pretty good, right? I picked yeah. a good one. Yeah, this game rules. <laughs> yeah. I would, I would love to learn this. Yeah, I, I might. I might as well. Uh, oh, you're in a install or something. Yeah. I don't really know how to capitalize on that fully, truth be told. Ah. I just like how quick Damn. everyone moves in this game. <laughs> I, I've been told I'm uh, a rushdown type player by my girlfriend, who knows way more about fighting games than I do. So, uh, I guess that's my style. I like it when a fighting game on the character select will just straight up tell you, like, hey, this is how they play. It is convenient. I'll play yeah. as this weirdo character who I think is two characters in one. First love, I, I, Nutcracker. I, I will have to call the cops. Yeah. <laughs> I, okay. I'll do, do, uh, up, we, up. This stage. I think this is their stage, if not mistaken. I, I, okay, I'm going to say... We have a history of D3 publisher, right? We did the entire Simple 2000 series in Japan, in England. And actually, we did, because we have to go back and clean up. But still, 
Uh, and then I also... Whoa. Is this the final boss? It might be. I, I lost track of what I was saying. Something about D3. Right, right. We have a history of D3. We did the whole Simple Series in Europe. We, uh, or rather, myself, Sid, and Devious Vacuum did uh, Onishambara Origins. And Humble, I think it's still on, has a D3 bundle that is, like, really trashy-ass looking games. So, it was my birthday recently. I have money now, so I was like, I'll get this bundle and I'll test them out, see if any of these are bad, and if they're bad enough to be, like, good stream fodder. Because they look supremely embarrassing, too. Yeah. Uh, I played through almost all of them in the stream. Not all the way through, but I, I demoed most of them in the stream. I would say, except for the Oni Chambara games, uh, and I do plan on getting to Z2 Chaos eventually, but other than the Oni Chambara games, all the games in there are either just boring, or boring and I'm worried we'll get banned from Twitch. Yeah. <laughs> to just a disgusting degree. Like, I don't mean to be a prude, but like, oh, I felt creepy playing some of those. Mr. Taka said that was a battle of 5'11 versus 6 foot tall. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think that might have been the final boss. Yeah, who's down here? Yeah, that's the final boss. <laughs> okay. Oh, so Slayman's also the final boss. No, no, no. Just this, this guy, okay. I think. Uh, he felt like a final boss hey, because I was di uh, dollar store kite Kisuke right over here. <laughs> I, I was a hundred percent not paying attention while I was talking. <laughs> but, uh, you still uh, won. So, yeah, so that's pretty much the final boss. I'm gonna say, hey, when we do our real match, let's not pick that guy. I think that's fair. Oh, soccer. Goal and seal. Back last check says creeper cam yeah i felt like it <laughs> if i knew how to work obs better i should have set up a creeper cam <laughs> for my avatar oh oh for a ninja character uh <laughs> there's some really slow moves this one has <laughs> Oh, that was an effective use of teleport. And that's an effective use of throwing, you see. Player one, one. Round two, fight. Oh. Yeah, I think that the move there when you get them up in the air is just mash out like low punch. Yeah. That seems to give you the most effective on hits. Oh, ho, 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 right into the net. Oh, it almost feels like you can Gatling moves, especially when you're in the air. Ooh, just barely yeah, got that some... one out. One. She has some moves that are slow to come out. <laughs> like, her normals are fast, when you get to a super, she goes like, Alright, I'm winding up. Here comes the big one. Uh, how about one more, and then the, sure. the real one? Should probably play his main protagonist, guys. See if he's just, like, very basic inputs. Uh, have if you played this guy yet? Uh, no. Okay. It's hard to tell. Like, I like how it's, like, very significantly different costumes for different people, but uh, it makes it hard to tell if we pick somebody already. Ooh, Arizona. An exotic locale, to be sure. Oh, Fatal Fury ass stage here. Round one. Except we're facing the wrong way. <laughs> oh! <laughs> now two can play that game, I see. Yeah. 
Uh, Gail Pond in chat asking, what game is this? This is Kenju, an unreleased game, but a fucking banger of a game. Dreamcast, right? Uh, Sammy Atomus Wave, but it runs in Flycast, because the Sammy oh, okay. Atomus Wave just used that sort of Dreamcast hardware. So it's been very easy for people to port those games to Dreamcast. These handful of arcade games that were released on that hardware by Sammy. Round two, fight! Oh, that camera did a thing. Ooh. Oh! Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, I ran right into that one. Right, I don't love the main protagonist of this game. That's all right, though. I think I kind of like how this this guy plays. You're thinking of your character. Well, yeah, this is, is, this is the one for all the marbles. Yeah, it's it's between two for uh, me. I'm gonna go with this lady because I like her design a lot. Can I'm gonna I go with this guy her? again. Uh, let's see. Let's go with. Okay. Pick a good stage for a final battle. Versailles. Sure. <laughs> All right, best of luck, Sharky. Thank you. You too. Oh, I hate your guy. What the f- ah. Oh, you- That's- <laughs> You- Brutal. I was worried you were going to punish that move I was doing. Uh. Oh, I thought I was getting that. No. Ooh. Ooh, thank God, I'm still in the fight. Okay. All right. Player one, one, eleven. Oh, dang it. I'm really having a hard time getting the air drive to come out right now for some reason. I can't get a, a, a grab grab, like a throw to come out. No, shit! Oh, there we go. No! Ah. Uh. Dude, people are sleeping on this game. This rules. Shit! No! No, wait. Oh, oh, oh. oh. No! <laughs> Do you want to know how to get in touch with Gao win quote? <laughs> I've been repressed. Well played, Sharky. Thank you. Here's you did good screen. too. That was a close one. Story. Yeah, they have. Uh, I don't think the story is fully. I think going through arcade mode just uh, tells you this all the story beats, just the same as anything. Unfortunately, this is this is not the stream to show yeah. that off. Uh, we're gonna have to say goodbye to Kenju for now, fun though it may be. Don't even mind losing in that one. I mean, I am. I'm fierce. I'm fucking pissed. I lost in my fucking <laughs> game. Uh, but you know that right. game is just I, so good that I need to step away for a moment just to. I'm gonna use the restroom real quick, but uh, I will tell you what my next game is. So you can go ahead and load it up. You can watch that intro movie, uh, Guilty Gear XX. Oh yes, or Guilty Gear X2. However you want to say it.
That's how it's titled in Launchbox, so that's what I'm yeah. going to call it. <laughs> All right. So, so and we're just playing base Guilty Gear X2 for PlayStation 2. You may be wondering, why not Accent Core? Why not Reload? Uh, this is the one I grew up with. This was my first Guilty Gear game, was just Guilty Gear X2, so I wanted to play it. I think that's more than fair. And I'll be right back. Gives me time to adjust the volume on this. Arc system works, baby. Johnny Baghead pointing out that there's finally going to be Baghead representation on stream. <laughs> I will let the sick intro play out. Popping for brisket as they should. Oh, and sure enough, it's gonna do a thing where the controllers are wrong. Uh, Parsec, it's it's okay. great. It's 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 awesome. I I hate how it always always puts the wrong controller in first slot. Uh, I want to respond to what uh, Johnny Baghead said. Hey, good news. Faust is my main in every Guilty Gear. Hell yeah. Bagheads will be represented. I will say I have played a little bit of uh, Guilty Gear. This this uh, flavor. Not this specific PS2 one, but uh, whichever one. Accent Core, I guess. Accent Core plus R on Steam. Yeah. Uh, you actually, we probably want to go to just versus two player. That's probably oh, awesome. right. I forgot how menus work. I tried pressing triangle to back out, but instead it select. A, just let me. No, just let me hit start and get out of here. Uh, and Jesus Christ, look at this Dick Tracy coloration on. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Okay. Versus two player. Please select your character! Alright, I need to remember gonna, who I'm actually good at in this version of the I'm game. practice with my name. After so I'll much strive. But it's always Biken for me. Biken and Johnny, I, those are my two characters that I play as depending on the game. Really, Johnny's kind of a complicated one. Yeah, the coins and whatnot, but they're, they're cool. What can, what can you say? They do cowboy shit. Let me just check buttons real quick. Kick. Heavy slash. Dust. Uh, I don't want to accidentally hit my burst. You know what? It's a, it's a practice. Let me see if I hear what burst is. Oh, what is burst? That's not burst. Is that instant kill? Or yeah, round over. <laughs> you win. Hey, chat. Does anyone remember how to do a burst in X2? Did you do that by accident? Did you straight up accidentally no, do no, that? No, I I know how to I know how to do okay, kills in this game. God, I, I've never been good against playing against uh, Faust. Because <laughs> all this shit like is favorite, just so random. My favorite archetype of a fighting game character is just, like, let Jesus take the wheel. Like, I, I am going to throw out some moves. Uh, you don't know what they are, and neither do I. <laughs> we both have to deal with this. Oh, don't tell me I fucked that up. Oh, damn. Oh. <laughs> God, you got lucky. I should have blocked. I should have mid-air blocked. Uh, Mr. Chaco says heavy slash and dust. Thank you. Dust is R1. 
Uh, yes. I didn't even get really a chance to get a feel for my moves again because I insta killed in the first round. And I think I picked the wrong color for Johnny. I think it's going to be Dick Tracy looking motherfucker again. I think uh, square is default color. Okay, I press square. Okay, we're good. Yeah. Oh, I skipped the intro. I can't remember how to toss coins. There we go. So that tells me you're much better at Guilty Gear than I am. <laughs> uh, like I said, I've, I've played this game. Ah, dang it. Oh, there he goes. There goes the president. Goodbye. <laughs> Can you see me? I'm invisible. <laughs> oh no, what will I do? <laughs> I mean, I'm doing dog shit, so. <laughs> it's been a while since I played as Johnny, so I guess I don't remember all the moves, as it were. He's not in strive yet, is he? Literally just walked into that. Yeah, well. <laughs> What you say? Oh no, Johnny's in Strive now. Is he? Okay, good for him. Yeah, season three. Your Where bottom left oh, wait, corner. I... Yeah, I got lost. Uh, uh, Zappa. I fucking love Zappa. God, I really wanted Zappa to show up in uh, Strive. I don't care if it doesn't make sense story-wise. I want him to show up. <laughs> Like, I don't even think Esco is around anymore. Ooh. I also do not know how to play his brisket. I know she has a yo-yo. <laughs> I keep thinking I'm going to get... Strive on PC at some point. I have it on PlayStation. I just kind of want it on PC now. Hey, guess what? You have it on PC now. Okay. Problem. Mara has it. I don't want to take up time if Mara I have it as well. Okay. Other thing. Uh, I I don't think I can just buy the DLC for myself. I can <laughs> so buy it. I, Well, the thing is, I think you don't... Do you not have the DLC? Someone has the DLC. I have some of the DLC. We have Steam okay. family sharing for the, for the benefit of the audience. Yes. Ah, oh, you want. Because, like, whoever owns the DLC has Season 1 and Season 2, but does not have, um... What's the word I'm looking for? Season 3. That's so, me. no Elfet. So, no Elfet, no Johnny. Maybe I will pick it up. I could buy it for you. In 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 turn, buy it for me. Yes, potentially. Please. You got so distracted. You let you let me win, even though I'm playing a character yeah. I have no idea how to play. Oh, I, thing is, I love Zappa, but I suck at Zappa. I, I probably I think I used to be okay with Zappa, but uh, let me let's get cool. dizzy. I mean, we could just play let this me, all night. I mean, we could just you know. Put off the... I, yeah, absolutely. Uh, God, husband and wife or go of soul? Ah, uh, husband and wife. Cute couple. Oh, I picked the wrong color. No, no I'm to find out what it is. Pro Striker 92 says Zappa looks like something from The Exorcist. Yeah. And his uh, 
Do they the moment? His, the ghost that follows him around is the straight up ring reference. In fact, his instant kill is a, the ring reference. Look, I just th think this game needs the uh, the live in New York, live in LA soundtracks. I need to do a yeah. a hack of this that just replaces those songs with Absolutely. vocal arrangements. I I have wondered, like, I I really want to do one of those as one of our stream intros, our pre shows. I just don't know what the copyright is. Like, do, do they care about that? Probably one? not. Never forgive a shenanigan. Yeah, like that. You can have your, like, uh, calls, call, not calls, your little mottos in Strive for your profile. And, like, Never Forgive a Shenanigan has always been mine in that game. It's so, like, no one's going to get it. <laughs> Except for, like, the most hardcore Guilty Gear fans. I don't really know how to play Kai, even if he's relatively simple. <laughs> Oh, I am cornered. Uh, should have gone for a dust, but oh well, I mean, I got a combo that killed, so whatever. I just realized I haven't been talking for a while, but I just fucking love this game. No, yeah, that's fine, no. <laughs> it's, 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 I think with Fight Night, the expectation's a little different. I think we're allowed to enjoy ourselves a bit more on this night and to get in the game. Ah, uh, I missed. All right. Oh. Thing is, I almost thought about like suggesting Guilty Gear XX as my good game, and then just original Guilty Gear as my bad game. Original Guilty Gear is fucking wild because if you do an insta kill in that game, uh, that ends the whole match. Yeah, you so can I do heard. an insta kill on on the first round, and it, you win. <laughs> I mean, it's an instant kill; they're dead at the end yeah. of it, so. For a long time, I was like, I, I wanted insta-kills to come back and strive. I wanted them like, hey, patch this in. I realized that would fuck up the balance of the game and like what the game is. So I made a concession now. I want Arxis to just make cutscenes of what an insta-kill would look like in strive. It's like, you know, I'd be happy with that. Just put out like a, a little thing for the fans, like, hey, if we had insta-kills, they look a little something like this. They can do that for April Fools instead of that. Uh, they did an okay April Fools joke this year with that one character random reveal. Guy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I kind of like Jam. She, she's the rushdown character, I gather. Oh, well, I whiffed that. <laughs> Oh yeah, Slayer's fucking coming to Strive. He's like the next character. I mentioned that in the uh, paintball stream and I forgot it since then. I have a feeling that you might like Chip to an extent. You'd probably like Chip in terms of how he plays, and then you'd hate Chip when you realize, oh, I have no life. Well, I'm a glass cannon oh, I... type anyway. Oh, fuck. Yes! <laughs> I haven't seen this. Well played. Thank you. Please select your character! You ready to put marbles yeah, on the like, line? It's, yep. Also, it's a random haiku every time. I think he just pulls random lines. I mean, this is the first matchup. I didn't do great at it. I did better as Dizzy. You did. But I can't... Beat me as Bridget, but I was playing as Oh, Zappa I also forgot to and update and the scoreboard. You won Kenju. I need to set that to a two. So okay. That's... Okay. I gotta stick by my girl. She is so cool.
Ooh, it's a Tommy Got. Heaven or hell, duel one. Let's rock. <laughs> God. Look, I've done no damage to you. Uh, I'm playing bad too, so. Or my way. Oh. What the? Oh. I don't know this fucking guy. I don't know his moves. I don't know his ways. <sighs> Okay. Double or nothing. No. <laughs> Double or nothing. If you win this, you get two points. Then I win the night. That's <laughs> how that works. I'm willing to put that on the line. It's on it's not fair to you. <laughs> I'm I'm putting my faith. I'm putting my faith in Dizzy. Alright. Alright, Dizzy. Show me the way, Angel of Victory. Heaven or hell. Little lady with a burst on that one, admittedly. You'll notice I'm not doing any Roman cancels, and that's because, uh, I don't remember how to do it in this game. I'm fully aware of what I'm doing. can you see? Triple or no? No, I'll have to... I'm fully aware. Okay. I'll take my two drink ups, and I will play your screen, and... I'm fully aware of what I'm doing. Can you see? We don't have to do double or nothing. We could just say that was one. One shot. I'm fully aware of what I'm I'll doing. Do the other two in a Can second. You see? Uh, that's too many drink ups in a row. Oh, too many drink ups in a row for me. I'm. I can't. I'm doing. I'm you know, I'll you meter out my drink ups. That does mean I've lost for the night. Yeah. <sighs> Two, three, four, five. Okay. I. I. Think I know what my punishment is going to be. <sighs> three. I think. Oh, while you do those strings, I'm going to eat. <laughs> Okay, that's five shots of tequila. Okay. Well played, Sharky.
Thank you. Maybe if I had gone with Jam. Maybe if I had gone with Jam in that situation instead. May I be brutally honest? <laughs> yeah, laid on me. I don't think that would have helped. Okay, that's fair. <laughs> Well, I've only got one more game left uh, up in my pocket. You've got one game in your pocket, too. Yeah. False is a character that if you don't know what you're doing against him, uh, it's not going to help. But how dope would it have been? How fucking sick would it have been if I had somehow pulled that out? <laughs> I, I, was, I was thinking, like, I can't throw this. Because, like, he would know. He would know if I threw it. I would have known. And it would have been, been you know what? It, it, it would have, it would have been insulting to you if I threw it. No, yeah, no. you, you respect yeah, me enough. I, I respect you enough. I'll take yeah. the loss. Yeah, it's all. Uh... The next game, <laughs> next game on the list tonight is uh, the best game tonight because it is best of best. Released nineteen ninety four, developed, published by Sony. Sun A. Uh, Pro Striker ninety two asks makes me wonder what is the worst game to play while drinking alcohol? Uh the game the uh cops let you play where you blow into the thing. <laughs> oh, I love that game. <laughs> I could beat this drunk. I could drink and play this game all night. Ooh, left ear. I believe Sun A is a Korean company that made uh all manner of a bootleg fight games. I'm going to have to do a volume check on this one. It's also doing the fucking aspect ratio thing again. There's also no audio on the attract screen, as far as I can tell, but... I'm going to bet it's 128, 128. Yeah. Wait, no, it's not, because I could see the, the credit thing getting Ooh. cut off there. Oh, there's Arnold! Oh, I, I saw another familiar face. Semi-familiar. Oh, I see a third familiar face. I think it's going to be like 80... Let's do 84 and 84. I'm eyeballing this shit to a certain extent. Yeah, it's close enough. Okay. Pro Striker 92 uh, says best of best. Paul S says not best of best. Uh, Pro Striker 92 wins. It is best of best. Yes. Good guess though, Paul S. <laughs> yeah. uh, hit start now. We have Tom, Hawk, Shalin, Abdul, Scott, Sasuke, Tango, and Ali. You got an extra L in between all the games you played. <laughs> Brutal. I'll be Hogan. I mean Hawk. No, I guess I'll be Tango. Art of sure right. killing. Oh, quarter circle starting from up. Weird. The battle's not always the strong, by the way. So. What? The... <laughs> Yeah. I don't know what word I would use to describe the audio quality of these sound effects. Crunchy. Yeah, that's it. Crunchy. It's like fucking... Rice Krispies and milk, crunchy. I, I recognize that pose from your character. I, I recognize yeah. that, Tango. I recognize that, Sprite. <laughs> I should have paid more attention to my art of sure killing moves. Ow. I think I know what character I'm going to go with. 
I think I know a character I'm not gonna go with. Let's see, there's a windscreen. Continue. Let, let's see how this plays out. <laughs> oh, that's like a medic. I was hoping he'd like punt him. Right, let's try Shalin. I'm gonna try Scott. Oh my Not god. Uh, yeah, I, I guess I got that. That's not always the strong. That's some bad posture. You just really see like a chiropractor. What is this move? What am I doing? You can say that about every character in this fucking game. Every move, every animation. Like someone was saying Zappa looked like the exorcist. Look at this fu this fucking like kick I can do. If I can get it to come out again. Hello. Why were you just- Scott is unmanly? Because you, you kicked me while I was crawling away. Huh? Close. What? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> it's a mechanic, baby. So I just have to let you recover if that happens? No, I mean, you can, you can go for the hit. You just won't be very sportsmanlike. No, I think it did no damage to you. Because that should have been the kill, right there. I don't know what move I just did there, but... Ooh, well played. Also, folks, let me know if the audio is too loud on this one. It better off being a little lower in the mix. I don't want to see this lady crawl. That is, is undignified for her. Uh... The Saki. I'll go with Tom. Tom's art is sure killing. Come on down. The Tom's art is sure killing. I only found a move. Chicken, 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 chicken. Chicken, 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 chicken. I want chicken, I want liver. Now mix me out, please deliver. Jesus Christ, I go flying. No clue what my character's movies are. I have not been able to intuit any of them. Well, I mean, they showed Except you all the moves. We just, uh... They showed you all of your moves. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. They don't show Player 2's moves. Oh, I have a dash? I didn't even try and assume this game would have that. Well, assumptions make an ass of you and I. Yeah. <laughs> Stylin'. Profiling. Hooray! <laughs> You know, as fucked up as this game is, and it is fucked up, it's still kind of playable, it moves at a pace. 
It, I mean, it uh, is not the worst game we played tonight, by far. <laughs> Um, it's almost not fair, given the nature of um, Mortal Kombat 8. Yeah. <laughs> Anyone coming in late hearing me say that is like, oh, they're being really hard on MK versus DC. Johnny Baghead uh, argues that it's actually the best game we played tonight because it's the best of best game. Uh, out of the best games we played tonight, this is the best of the best games, but I don't think it's the best of the games that we played tonight. Right, I don't think either of us so played almost right. Sasaki yet. No, I did. I just did, literally. Oh, well. Who haven't we played as? Uh, Ali and the Abdul. Abdul's to the left. All right. Uh, Mr. Taco uh, reading the highlight this message saying, It's still kind of playable. There's zero knockdown throw admissibility. Once someone is thrown, you can just walk up and throw them again until you win, enjoy your solved game. <laughs> well, that would require knowing how to throw in this game. I think that, that drop is, like, universal. I don't like the way this guy gyrates in his loincloth moves during the gyration. I also don't like his, his black pixel nipples. <laughs> oh god, yeah, they're in the wrong place too, I think. Yeah, I found it. Well, I'm, you... I'm not going to do a thorough loop. That is... I'm going to consider that... Uh, what's the game say? Unmanly? Yeah. I do like that move. I like how it says, you win, which makes me think that the arcade machine had a little, like, robotic hand that, that would, would come out. That would point at whoever point. won the match. Yeah. I like that explosion sound that is just someone going... <laughs> with her mouth. Ugh. Little knife dance, little knife dance. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, pick your I'm best. This is, this is the one. Yeah. Uh... Take my best of the best of the best. Did so, I win as any of these yeah. characters? Uh, Tom, I think. Yeah, no, fuck it. I'm gonna lose no matter what, so I might as well. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> the battle is not always to the strong, though. You just gotta bear that in mind. Jesus wept! I'm not going for a thorough loop there, that's just happening. <laughs> Oy vey. 
we are missing the best stage in this game, by the way, as Bob Manier pointed out. It's the one with the Statue of Liberty from Home Alone 2, who, who pokes their head towards the screen. Oh, yeah. I'm going for throws, I'm not doing a, a loop. Hope you're proud of yourself. <laughs> and not really. <sighs> Another brutal night for Cass tonight. <laughs> Five points for you. Here's your little animation. Thank you. That was best of best. Uh, we still have one more game to play before whatever punishment you decide to inflict on me. Uh, this is your last pick. This is Kaneko's Blood Warrior, released 1993. Let's see if I have to crop the sides off of this one again, because RetroArch is being such a... No, this should just be good, so I can go ahead and undo those. I, something has gone horribly wrong with RetroArch in the past updates. I've been having all sorts of different issues with it as of late. I'm hoping that 1.18 resolves some of it. Between the resolution changing, some input issues I've had, uh, and also just the application fucking crashing. Uh, which is definitely uncool. But, uh, what can you do? All right. Two coins for us. Do me a favor, press start. Right. <clears throat> oh, wait, did it select a character for me? Did it? Press start. Huh? I'm not sure what the fuck happened there, but... I'm controlling the guy on the left, you're controlling the guy on the right. Yeah. Well, I guess we'll be these two for this first match. Is this a three-button game? I don't remember. Four-button. Wait a sec. This button's not doing anything. God damn it. Uh, oh! What? Yeah, my buttons are bound weird. Yeah, I, fucking RetroArch. Okay. What should your B button be? I guess we'll make it uh, fire too. I guess I I don't know what all. No, you're no, no. It's it's, it's double. It's double bam. Make it three. Okay, we're good. Yeah, switch it to left bumper for some reason. Hmm. There's like that too. No. No. Good enough. Yep. Because I. I wasn't paying enough attention to what moves were, so I don't know how to play as this guy. Yeah, Mortal Kombat eat your heart out. Look at all this blood in this game. Yeah, your stun animation is just you lose blood at like a horrifying rate. I know this game also has fatalities, so I don't know what they are. They're, no, they're, I will say they're underwhelming. You do a fatality in this game by killing someone with a special move. Any. <laughs> but the thing is, uh, what it does is it applies an effect that gives you like a more gruesome death, and there's just three of them. And that's it. They're very much not unique. Fair enough. Bob and are saying this game feels like a tie-in for a tokusatsu show that doesn't exist. Yeah. <laughs> that would be the, uh, the, uh, the Journey to the West digitized fighter on PS1, too. Yeah, I've been wanting to find an excuse to play that on stream. Hey, guess what? We have Fight Night. <laughs> we have this program. Oh, no, no, no. Here's the, here's the thing. Here's the thing. 
We need the cutscenes in that, yeah, too. Yes. I might need to pay someone to translate that game. Translate the cutscenes in it. In the story mode. Oh, well. <laughs> Actually, okay, so I think you just press a button when it says finish him and you do it. Winner. Okay. I'm going to pick the Kappa, and I'm going to... Oh, wait, no, no, wait. Yeah, no, we're stuck in... Okay, I'm going to restart it, because it was being such a pain in the ass about. Yeah, I okay. think I might be stuck as that character. Let me press start first. Okay. Now you press start. Okay, I'm going to be the Kappa, and I'm going to try as hard as possible to win. So you can get that victory screen? Yeah. Maybe I... we both be the Kappa, just to make sure it happens. Sure. So... Uh, okay. You know, it's an odd number of fighters anyway, so. And we get good sounds all around. Double the sounds. Dalzing, meet your heart out. Ah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oof. Jeez. Alright, well, hit a button, finish me. Yeah, it makes sense. I punched your feet and it blew up your upper torso. See that windscreen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright, I gotta blow my nose. Hit okay. start, pick your character, I'll pick this one. And hopefully, if I let it time you, you out, I'll have enough time to blow my nose. I'll play... I'll play the Spooky Kabuki. Boy, they sure give you a lot of time to pick a character on this. Yeah, arcade game that's like, hey, no rush. That was it timing out. I, I need to know. Oh. <laughs> I should have maybe paid attention to what my specials were. Because they had so much time. One of them was just a bunch of peas. Heavy metal top. Heavy metal top. Jesus. <laughs> I like how uh, my victory counter is a little Puyo. I couldn't do anything <laughs> about that. Oh, Kabuki! <laughs> oh, Kabuki! Collusion! <laughs> Hey guys, we had a lot of fun here today. <laughs> but remember, don't actually try this at home. <laughs> All right, who did you who did you pick in the first round? Did you pick? Uh, I think I picked, yeah, you picked Arashi. That guy. So I'll be Ben K. He's got a whole bag of tools. So I'll be. I can't even read it because it's blue on blue. <laughs> I still can't you read, read it. it because the font treatment's so bad. Yep, and uh, the... zero for three. <laughs> Again, maybe I should have paid attention to what the uh, specials is were. Guy... But... Oh yeah, your guy is Banke, as in the historical. Yeah, they're you know legendary Banke. Seven weapons on his back. I'll take your word for it. If I remember correctly, and I usually don't. Uh, the story of Banke is that he was like defending he, had, he carried a whole bunch of weapons on his back and had, uh, he defended a bridge 
uh, at something. Oh, God, I'm telling this story terribly. The famous story of him is that he said he defended a bridge against a whole bunch of, like, fighters and held them all off. And he was full of arrows at the end of it. And he stood there on the bridge, just covered in arrows, but not moving, like, holding everyone back just by standing there and glaring them down. And hours later, when someone finally came to make sure uh, he was dead, he died standing on his feet. That's how I want to go out. That, and that character inspired Gilgamesh in Final Fantasy. Because, you know, he carries all the weapons, battle on the big bridge. Well, it seems like he's a I buster. Have... seems like he's a punk because he got his ass kicked. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, he is still standing. He, he died standing, so... <laughs> That's true. Video Game King linked to a thing about uh, Ben K. Yeah, because I probably told every part of that terribly. <laughs> so Final I would suggest matchup. reading. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Uh, Gone for every character. All right. I think if any, if anything, if you've learned anything from me watching our streams is that if I try to teach something I'm saying it wrong and I'm, <laughs> I'm fucking up details so the lesson you should learn from me is don't learn lessons from me <laughs> I, I went I walked right into that I guess I, I flew right into that technically Why am I? Why am I trying to do that? Why? <laughs> why am I like this? Not that it even fucking matters at this point. <laughs> yeah, sure, whatever. <laughs> oh, Kabuki. <laughs> What's your secret? Oh, Kabuki. Uh, let's update that scoreboard and let's show your victory screen. And because you won the night, let's show it one more time. Another night, another near shutout. Ay, ay, ay. Ay. Congratulations, Charky. Two in Thank a row. Uh, and, and again, the score disparity here is... Whew, hey, boy. Uh... <laughs> okay. I'm, I'm ready to accept my punishment. I had two ideas in mind. One of them is truly a punishment, but I think it would be frustrating for me too <laughs> ultimately uh and one of them is uh fun for both of us but i think it's still technically house as punishment i'll tell you i'll tell you them both and you choose and don't choose based on just on suffering because you know which one is the more suffering choose based on what you think is going to be more entertaining to watch okay first one is let me practice guilty year x2 on you <laughs> We just play more of that. I mean, I, I'll kick your ass, but I need to get better at it. The other thing is we go back to a radio helicopter from the Simple 2000 series, and you just try to clear the tutorial. Oh, my God. E I'm either I continue to kick your ass in fighting games, or you do something that you play a game that I like and you fucking hate. <laughs> I'm going to put it to the audience. Just We're not going to run a poll. Just everyone say either Radio Helicopter or Guilty Gear in chat, and we'll give it a minute. And uh, that'll be how we determine who's actually watching and who's not. Uh, <laughs> and also how, how we determine. Yeah. Yeah, chat's going to Radio Helicopter. Yeah. This is going to hurt for me, too, because I like Radio Helicopter. 
and it's, it's going to be you shit talking it the whole time. If anyone has any yeah, last seconds, gonna be... votes to the contrary. Uh... <laughs> Shut up, Sharky. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Don't you it fucking radio post helicopter. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, I guess I'm going no, back no. for some radio helicopter. <laughs> Did someone redeem say something nice during Guilty Gear X2? <laughs> Did that happen? No, I don't believe so. Okay. <sighs> Just have to get past the tutorial. That's it. Or until, like, we run out of time. <laughs> Well, I have an hour. Yeah. It's Reminder that be this careful. game first featured in... Was this the first episode of the Simple 2000 Euro Trip? I think it was. Released 2004, developed by Tomcat System on behalf of D3 Publisher and also 505 Game Street in Europe. Yeah, I can read. All right. Really, the trick is really just learn the control scheme. That's kind of it. Like, if you play the game on its level, you're willing to meet it halfway and be like, okay, I'll learn how this works. It's not that bad. And the argument I made in our in our um, ranking of this game, the reason why I put it so high, is that you do get better controlling helicopters. It does become easier to play. In fact, yeah, you don't even need to go into the first mission right now. You can just get used to the controls here. Oh my god, these are inverted. Holding in the right stick puts you to the left. Hold, and right, right analog stick to the left makes you go right. Right analog stick to the left makes you go... Or right analog stick to the right makes you go left. You could fix that in the uh, settings. Now it's inverted okay. turning. But now left and right work on the left stick to turn. Oh, God. curious about something. I, I'm gonna have to flip this. I, I literally can't fucking play like this. With those inverted yeah, things. I, I already... In fact, that's... When I said you can change in the settings, that's what I meant. I meant in PCSX. Uh, but do I have it inverted on mine? I don't think I do. No, that's weird. Like... Because I don't remember it playing like that, and I don't have anything, like, set here to say, like, okay, automatically flip those things around. The only controls in this are the two analog sticks, by the way, as far as I'm aware. Yep. I will be timed on this. This is where we crashed and burned during the Euro trip. And then I played it a bit. I said, yeah, I'm, like load up parsec and i didn't do well either but i enjoyed it i ended up getting it on my own and like you know playing and i eventually got competent enough at it it's it's really the key really is just like light touches feathering it yeah like sometimes if you want to go down it, it's better to not even like what the fuck what did I fucking crash into? Suck me on the, the dick, radio the wall, helicopter. Hit the wall of that thing. No, you, you did hit the wall of that thing. No, I fucking you gotta, didn't. You, you really, you really gotta pay attention to like the edges of your uh, rotors. In time, you'll find out who's right. Oh, suck yeah. me. I, I'm, I'm looking at it. I'm, I'm seeing you hit these things. It's fucking bullshit. If, if I, it I, helps, I, 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 I flick. 
the right analog stick up, and it's like, oh, you want to go into the fucking ceiling? If it helps, imagine that your rotors are way bigger than they are, because, like, I, I think you're just not getting the spatial awareness of it. I don't have any spatial awareness in the first place. You know, I don't have any depth perception, so... Well, this is a 2D image, so... <laughs> I mean, it's a 3D image projected on a 2D screen. It'd be cool if I could, like, move the camera around. Oh, L1. That, that's great. That's a uh, super helpful fucking camera there. Yes, you might you might get this. Once you left. Uh, someone did redeem me, say something nice. I have nothing nice to say about this game. It, I think this game is fun. I think it's a challenge to really get a grip of the controls, but once you do, I think it opens up and it's a fun little challenge. You did it? You couldn't do it in the first episode, but you did it now. That was short. Way to go. I don't feel good about it. I do. I'm proud of you. You got it first try. Is that the one I just did? Yes, that is. Hey, grind for money. <laughs> oh, this is the same one? Yeah, I, 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 you I, just picked the same level. <laughs> Once you do the tutorial, you can go around the house and pick other levels. Hey, you've completed the challenge. Yeah, I know. At this point, you're just doing this for fun. <laughs> Cute. Uh, yeah, fun, not the operative word here I'd use. Are you sure you don't want to crash really? me right here? Are you sure you want to, you're going to let me get no, away with fine. this game? You're fine. Yeah. <laughs> now, you went too heavy on it. I couldn't fucking tell because the camera is such fucking dog shit in this game. No, I would not. Okay. I'll try a third one. I want to see what the next one in this game is. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to remember. I think if you wanted to, you could go to the shop now, actually, and buy a new part if you wanted to and try to improve something. Is there a, a part that changes the controls to be, like, good? Uh, it can change your turning, it can change, like, your thrust and stuff, if I remember correctly. Can it shrink my hitbox so that it, uh, actually makes fucking sense? Uh, well, wait a minute. You can buy different bodies for your helicopter, I think. Oh my god, just tell me so where the next fucking smaller. mission is, game, by the way. Don't make me go from, like, don't make me go around in circles here trying to figure out, like, well, Was where it, could the next is, mission be? This, this is, like, teaching you... How to you know control the helicopter by having you explore? You know you're gonna have to figure out like okay what's the correct way to do this door. Also yeah you could just go to shop if you wanted to go to the shop. I'm going to the shop. I do like how you can just like explore. Okay so you get battery body engine gyro. So you don't have enough to get a new helicopter. But wait, go back to that screen. Have a helicopter. I'm curious. Uh, nah, it doesn't look like they have different sizes. And they all have body three hits. Yeah. No, you can't upgrade body to have more hit, uh, hit points. I would not get the core. <laughs> I would not do that. What if I want to have the D3 publisher logo on my... Well, you're going to need to go around for points. Engine's gonna change your horsepower, so you have to look a little giddy up. All right. Does that just automatically apply? E I believe so. So here's a mission. This is an interesting mission. I how did I get out of the room? <laughs> Teleport! Done it again, radio helicopter! No one's gonna do that. Like, 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 
two people in chat are going to get that joke. Eek! Cockroaches! Hurry, get them out of here! R1 Mun to spray repellent. There are eight roaches. He counted them. He had the time to count them, but you couldn't. Yeah. That one already yeah, crawled away roaches. under the. Uh... There's one. All right, that worked. Thank God. Sure. Since you don't have to Fuck. land on anything, the only thing you have to worry about is not going too high up to the ceiling. It's also very generous with the length of that uh, spray. See? Fuck! Got one, though. <laughs> yeah, but I only have one hit left. I know the one crawled There's underneath... There's one on the ground. The... Yeah, but... Uh, sure, I, I, I know exactly what happened there. Where's that one in the fucking ground? It, it, it's behind you. Wait. Is that all? No, actually, that was the doorway. Never mind. Got it. Relax. It's not going to be out there, so don't worry about that. Yeah. Then where the fuck are the other three? I have to hunt for them. You're not timed on this one. There's no, like... Puck's not taken down, so don't worry about it. Yeah. By the way, valid strategy what you're doing. Just spray and see if it hits something. <laughs> see, I see one. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm about to run That's out of battery. Oh, I guess you do have a time limit then. Battery. <laughs> there it is. There you go. You've completed two missions in this game. I, you, that, you know what? I think your punishment's done. You got it. You've Ooh, gone above thanks. and beyond. Here's some pocket money. Help me out again sometime, okay? Never. You don't have... You go. <sighs> and now you can see why I like this game. No, I can't actually. I <laughs> uh I really can't. <sighs> Congratulations again, Charky, on your Thank victory you. tonight. That was truly a hellish punishment. I truly lost <laughs> tonight. Uh Thank you everyone for tuning in. Thank you everyone for watching along. Thank you everyone for, for uh, voting on that punishment. I hate you all. Uh, and thank you for supporting the Bad Game Hall of Fame. Uh, thank you for turning out to Fight Night. Uh, despite everything, it was fun. We played a few good games tonight, which it's always good to be able to get away with on the stream. Uh, <laughs> what was your favorite game tonight, do you think? What's the standout game oh, to you? Guilty Gear X2. I think for like, me, it might be Kenju. I, I think I really do enjoy Kenju. I just really like the way that game feels. Uh, so that's one that I might just revisit just for funsies. But Guilty Gear is obviously fucking great, too. I'm not going to knock Guilty Gear, even though I lost real bad at it. Uh, even though it and cost me severely tonight. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that that bootleg one, I would say, is the worst, but that, oh, that feels like punching down at a certain point, because it's a bootleg course. Pro Striker 92 says Cassidy may lose tonight, but she's a winner in our hearts. Thank you. That doesn't make up for you voting for Radio Helicopter. You're hey, I voted. Ice. <laughs> I voted for Guilty Gear. I voted for Guilty Gear. Yeah, but the chat. I'm turning against the chat now. Okay. This is my heel turn arc, where where I become antagonistic towards chat and in position you as the face here. Okay, fair point. <laughs> Thank you, everyone, for uh, supporting Bad Game Hall of Fame. As I was saying, uh, consider subscribing on Twitch, pledging on Patreon, uh, boosting us on Discord to gain access to our Patreon Saints channel on the Discord, where you can vote for upcoming playthroughs. We are currently playing through Limbo of the Lost, 
on Thursdays. We did our first episode. The archive of that is up on YouTube. Highly encourage watching it. Uh, if only for the first 45-ish minutes where we go over the history of the Limb of the Lost that's not been covered in so much depth even by YouTubers who have done videos about Limbo the Lost. I feel like the story is criminally under-acknowledged, under-written about, so I, I really stand by that uh, that episode. Uh, and we'll continue, obviously, with the history reports on that game as, and history reports on the other games that we play. Uh, I, I feel like that's uh, a good differentiator between us and other stream channels, that we, we go... We, we go through the effort of, of documenting that history, and it's something I'm really proud of. Definitely something of a model moving forward that I want to stick to when it, when it comes to the appropriately historic games of that nature. Uh, that being said, we still haven't decided what we're going to play this coming Tuesday yet. Uh, we will... Yeah, last, last Tuesday we did Wrestling Empire, which was very fun, but that's not going to be a every week thing. It's going to be... We're going to revisit that for our next episode. So this coming Tuesday... Something else. We'll figure it out. We will indeed. We always do. Uh, yeah. But again, just thank you for for tuning in, regardless of whether you support or not. The, the you know it, we just like having folk around. We just like having an audience. This who shows up for these fight nights. Who shows up for all our other streams to, to cheer for us and jeer for us as the occasion calls for. Uh, I like the energy. Uh, and. Let's figure out who we should send this audience to, who is streaming at the moment. Uh, we'll send some folks to Squatulous's way. I'm not sure what they're playing. Right. Uh, but they, it... Oh, I, ju I just had co-host open and uh, had her post there. She is playing uh, PAL Wii games, PAL exclusive Wii games. That sounds good to me. That sounds like something that I would, that our viewers might get into. But again, thank you for tuning in, folks. I've been Cass. I'm Charky. I've been the loser. Charky has been the winner. Maybe next time my luck will turn around. Probably not. We will see. <laughs> but for now, bye. Good night, everybody.